bright reds, deep blues and grassy greens. These leaf shaped canvases stand four feet tall and they were painted by local artists in Burlington. The blue on Aiden Lee's canvas represents the beautiful water in the city and the red represents indigenous roots. Lee is one of the artists in the fundraiser and he says painting is about expression. I couldn't speak till I was four years old and I really had trouble expressing myself. Is that my mom decided, you know, why don't we try painting? And she gave me a paintbrush in my hand one day with a piece of paper and she said to me, why don't you try doing it? I remember drawing as a child, always. That was my escape. That was the way that I had fun with my friends. Barbara Reed loves art, but that wasn't the only reason why she participated. My dad was really unwell for the last few years of his life, so he spent a fair bit of time in Joseph Brand Hospital. And uh, as a family, we were there a lot, so it, it, it meant a lot to be able to give back. Jody Harrison started the fundraiser Burlington Artscape back in November. 50 local artists were chosen and she says they all had their own story. There were artists uh, that came to us um, that were cancer survivors. There were artists um, with autism, um, artists who had babies during COVID. Each painting will be sold for $750 with 100% of the proceeds going to the hospital. They're hoping to raise approximately $37,000. Right now, uh, Joseph Brandt Hospital is in need of funds for critical care. Uh, they have critical care expenses that are not covered and um, they're looking at investing in mental health. They're looking at um, paying off uh, essential equipment that our hospital needs. Even though online sales for the leaves begin on August 6th on their website, you can reach out to them before that on their Instagram page. And all the artwork will be displayed here at Grace United Church on August 8th, the 15th and the 22nd. Manisa Danabalan, CHCH News.